The Metropolitan Golf Association and the Golfing Union of Ireland engaged in a wonderful tradition that comes around every two years, the Governor Hugh L. Carey Challenge Cup matches. This international competition featuring six-man teams representing the MGA and the GUI is one of the most special events on the MGA calendar. This year, the ninth edition of the Carey Cup matches took place at Bethpage State Park in Farmingdale, New York, on the famed Black Course, a two-time U.S. Open venue. This year's edition of the matches was also marked by very challenging playing conditions. However, the skies brightened and conditions improved for day two for the six singles matches that would decide the Carey Cup. Going into the singles matches, the MGA held a 4-2 to two lead over the GUI and was poised for its first victory since 1996. Match one pitted the leader in the MGA Player of the Year points list, Michael Miller of Knollwood, against Alan Dunbar, Ireland's best player and a member of the 2011 Walker Cup team. Match two saw 14-year-old Cameron Young, the 2011 Carter Cup champion, against Dermot McElroy. Match three was the elder statesman on the MGA team, 50-year-old Dennis Lynch, who took on Aaron Carney. Match four was Connor Casey of Madison Golf Club in New Jersey, who took on Richard O'Donovan. Headlining match five was 16-year-old Clancy Waugh, who took on Gary McDermott. And anchoring the final match was two-time MGA Player of the Year Joe Saladino, who played Niall Gorey. The MGA needed two and a half points to claim the Carey Cup. The Miller-Dunbar match was one that everybody wanted to watch, and it did not disappoint. The two titans of the Carey Cup went back and forth, with Miller taking a two-up lead, Dunbar squaring the match and Miller holding a one-up lead down the stretch. As the players played the picturesque par 3 17th hole, Miller held that one-up lead, but Dunbar would have some fireworks of his own. He rolled in an amazing 80-foot putt to square the match with a birdie. As the two players played 18, the match was halved with fours, as Dunbar made a terrific par from the right bunker, sinking a 12-foot putt to square the match. But two matches in back of them, Dennis Lynch was making his mark on this, his home golf course. Lynch plays out of Nassau Players Club and is a recent club champion here at Bethpage Black. He won the first four holes to go four up and never look back, earning a five and four victory over Carney. That, combined with Miller's half point, meant that the MGA needed only one more point to win the Carey Cup. That one point was earned by Long Island's own Joe Saladino of Huntington. Saladino took a two up lead after the 10th hole, pushed it to three up after 13, and held that three up lead after winning the 15th hole with a birdie. On the beautiful downhill par 4 16th, Saladino needed to only have the hole to win the carry cup for the MGA. He went one better, earning a conceded par to gain a four and two victory over Gorey and clinch the carry cup for the MGA squad. Another point was earned by Waugh, who got a one up victory over McDermott. The final tally was MGA seven and a half GUI four and a half, and a wonderful victory celebration followed. The awards luncheon was marked by camaraderie, friendship, and good feelings on both sides. The luncheon was also left with this quote by GUI President Eugene Finn. We congratulate you upon your performance, and we ask you to take good care of the Carey Trophy, because in two years from now, we sure as hell are going to try very hard to no doubt the MJ squad will enjoy these next two years having the Carey Cup back in our possession on U.S. soil. And we'll look forward to the next edition of the Carey Cup matches in 2013 in Ireland. The Carey Cup matches are a wonderful tribute to the late Governor Hugh L. Carey, who passed away in August and was the founder and chief supporter of these matches. The Carey family was on hand throughout the week to support the matches and the MGA, and we had a wonderful three days at Bethpage. Thank you for watching video from the 2011 Kerry Cup matches won by the MGA over the Golfing Union of Ireland. Stay tuned to mgagolf.org for video from all MGA championships.